Hello trainees. My name is Monica. Today we are going to study drilling. Drilling. Objective. At the end of this topic you shall be able to state drilling process. Explain about types of drills. Drilling is the production of cylindrical holes of definite diameters in work pieces by using a multi-point cutting tool called a drill. Types of drills Flat drill Twist drill Deep hole drill Flat drill Flat drill bits are quite an earliest form of drill bit that can be used to very good effect over a range of applications. Advantages It is easy to operate. It is inexpensive to produce. Disadvantages It is difficult to hold during operation. Chip removal is poor. Twist drill Almost all drilling operation is done using a twist drill. Drills are made out of high-speed steel. It has two or more spiral or helical flutes formed along its length. Deep hole drill Deep hole drilling is done by using a type of drill known as D-bit. Question. Drilling is the process used for making A. Square block B. Slot C. Keyway D. Hole The answer is D. Hole Drill, Parts and Functions Objective at the end of this topic you shall be able to identify the parts of a drill. State the functions of each part of a drill. The various parts of the drill can be identified. Parts of a drill Point Shank Tank Body Point. The cone shaped end which does the cutting is called the point. It consists of a dead center, lips or cutting edges and a heel. Shank. This is a driving end of the drill which is fitted onto the machine. Shanks are two types. Tapper shank is used for larger diameter drills. Straight shank is used for smaller diameter drills. Tang. This is a part of the tapper shank drill which fits into the slot of the drilling machine spindle. Body The portion between the point and the shank is called the body of a drill. The parts of the body are Flutes Land or margin Body clearance Web Flutes are the spiral grooves which run to the length of the drill. It helps to form the cutting edges, removal of chips and coolant flow to the cutting edge. Land or margin is the narrow strip which extends to the entire length of the flute and the diameter of the drill is measured across the land or margin. Body 
body clearance is reduced in diameter to cut down the friction between the drill and the hole being drilled. Web is the metal column which separates the flutes. Question. What is the name of the part marked in X? A. Shank. B. Tang. C. Body. D. Point. The answer is B. Tang. Drill Angles Objective At the end of this topic you shall be able to Identify the various angles of a twist drill. State the functions of each angle. Designate drills as per ISI recommendations. Like all cutting tools the drills are provided with certain angles for efficiency in drilling. The different drill angles are Point angle or cutting angle Helix angle, break angle, clearance angle, chisel edge angle. Point angle or cutting angle. The point angle of a general purpose, standard, drill is 118 degree. The angle varies according to the hardness of the material to be drilled. Helix Angle Twist drills are made with different helix angle. The helix angle determines the rake angle at the cutting edge of the twist drill. According to Indian standards, three types of drills are Type N for normal low carbon steel 18 degree to 30 degree Type H, for hard and tenacious materials, 10 degree to 13 degree. Type S, for soft and tough materials, 35 degree to 40 degree. Break angle. Break angle is the angle of flute, helix angle. Clearance Angle The clearance angle is meant to prevent the friction of the tool behind the cutting edges. If the clearance angle is too much, the cutting edges will be weak, and if it is too small, the drill will not cut. Chisel Edge Angle This is the angle between the chisel edge and the cutting lip. Designation of drills Diameter Tool type Material Example A twist drill of 9.50 mm diameter of tool type H for right hand cutting and made from HSS is designated as Twist drill 9.50, H, IS5101, HS, where H equals tool type, IS5101 equals IS number, HS equals tool material, 9.5 equals diameter of the drill. If the tool type is not indicated in the designation, it should be taken as type and tool. Question. What is the name of the angle marked in X? A. Rake angle. B. Helix angle. C. Clearance angle. 
D. Point angle. The answer is A. Rake angle. Cutting speed. Objective. At the end of this topic, you shall be able to define cutting speed. State the factors for determining the cutting speed. Cutting speed is the speed at which the cutting edge passes over the material while cutting and is expressed in meter per minute. Cutting speed selection. The selection of cutting speed for drilling depends on the material to be drilled and the tool material. Tool manufacturers usually provide a table of cutting speed required for different material. Materials Cutting speed meter per minute Cutting speed calculation Cutting speed V equals pi dn divided by 1000 meters per minute. End notes RPM. V denotes cutting speed in meter per minute. D denotes diameter of the drill in millimeter. Pi denotes 3.14. RPM n equals V multiple of 1000 divided by D multiple of pi. Question, what is the unit of cutting speed? A. Kg cubic meter B. Newton per meter C. Meter per minute D. Kilogram per kilojoule The answer is C. Meter per minute Feed in drilling. Objective. At the end of this topic you shall be able to define the feed in drilling. State the factors affect the rate of feed. Feed. It is the distance, x, a drill advances into the work in one complete rotation. The rate of feed is depends on the finish required, type of drill, material to be drilled, table for feed rate. The manufacturers usually provide a table of feed rate depends on the drill diameter, drill diameter, millimeter, HSS. Rate of feed, millimeter per revolution. Question. What is the unit of feed? A. Kg cubic meter. B. Newton per meter. C. Millimeter per minute. D. Millimeter per revolution. The answer is. D. Millimeter per revolution. Drill holding devices. Objective. At the end of this topic you shall be able to name the different types of drill holding devices, state the features of drill chucks, state the functions of drill sleeves. For drilling holes on materials, the drills are to be held accurately and rigidly on the machines by using holding device. The common drill holding devices are Drill chucks Taper sleeves and sockets
drill chucks. It is used to hold the straight shank drills. For fixing and removing drills, the chucks are provided with a pinion and key. The drill chucks are held on the machine spindle by means of an arbor. Taper sleeves and sockets. It is used to hold the taper shank drills. Sleeves and sockets are made with the same taper so that will give a good wedging action while the engagement of taper shank drill. Question. What is the name of the object? A. Arbor. B. Drill chuck. C. Drill bit. D. Chuck key. The answer is. B. Drill chuck. With this, you completed the topics of drills, drill angles, cutting speed, feed and RPM, drill holding devices. Thank you.